Coach Matt from Tackle Train is bringing you a video on the definition of types of trends. Now, in the financial world, there are three types of trends. The first type of trend is what we call a bullish uptrend. A bullish uptrend is price appreciating over time, and it creates a higher, high, higher, low. Higher, high, higher, low. Now, as it creates a higher, higher, low, patterns have a tendency to repeat themselves. And as a trader, we simply say that what has happened in the past will continue to happen into the future until there is some unknown variable, whether it's an economic report, a fundamental report, an earnings report, something along the lines that are unknown variables creates the end of the pattern. Now, the second type of pattern is what we call a sideways neutral pattern, where there is no repeating pattern. We don't trade within this pattern. It's great for cash flow systems such as iron copper doors, credit spreads, naked puts, and covered calls. The third type of trend is what we call a bearish downtrend, where price depreciates over time, creating the pattern of the lower low, lower high, lower low, lower high. And once again, based on the history repeating itself, the trader simply says what has happened will continue to happen in the future. Now, what I want to look at is a little more closer in, turn, in terms of the bullish uptrend and the bearish downtrend. As price is, 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 price is bought at the support level, it drives the demand up. Now, as a trader, the only way to actually lock in profit is to close the transaction, is to close the trade. And so as it gets overbought, it then it, traders start to sell it. It drives the market back down into where it becomes oversold. And this pattern repeats itself over time. And if you just drew a, a trend line through it, what you would really kind of be looking at is the primary growth trend just looks like a 45 degree angle up, but it's created through this oversold over bought patterns. Now, in a bearish downtrend, something very similar happens. As the pattern goes lower, low, lower, high, lower, low, lower, high. As it gets oversold, traders start to lock in profit on the short positions, driving the market back up. It goes back up into resistance, gets overbought. Traders start to sell it again, shorting the stock, driving the stock market back back to the uh, over oversold. It just rinses and repeats. Patterns repeat themselves. And so thank you so much for joining us today for this very short video on types of trends. And if you like the video, make sure you like it on, on YouTube and share it with a friend.